But hold up, wait a minute. So all those, I was wondering if I was watching actual Korean movie because there were a lot of obscene scenes. Okay, there was an obscene scene. Like, seriously, seriously. Oh my God, I couldn't believe it. Like, <laughs> hi everyone. Thank you so much for doing this with me. Sorry, sorry. I've been away for a long, long time and I've been missing you. Funny enough, all the movies I've been wanting to review, yeah? I've been watching them all and I'm just like, oh gosh, this, this, these movies are just piling up, piling up all over the place. So I just woke up one day and I'm like, you know what? Just help your life. Help yourself. Let's just do something. So today we'll be reviewing. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. All right, this is the first time you're here. My name is Chacha Wabara. I hope you keep joining me. What we do here are movie reviews, TV drama reviews, Korean, Chinese, Turkish, Nigerian. You have it. Okay. Now today we'll be reviewing a Korean drama known as, okay, Money Heist. Korea Joint Economic Area. It's a 2022 drama. First, we have six episodes. They said it's supposed to be 16 episodes. I don't know. Or 12 episodes. I don't know. Um, right now, the first six episodes have come out. It came out last week, Friday. Mm -hmm. mm, yeah, 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 correct. And I saw this six episodes in less than a day it was that gripping it was that fantastic staring notable actors and actresses like yu jin tae kim yong jin park hin Sun, jun jong su lee wong jong and other actors and actresses too numerous to mention sorry about the name pronunciation but yeah that goes there's something about korean movies something about chinese movies all these asian movies most times more often than not the sensor, the censoring is really high. So there's nothing, no obscene scene, no um, use of foul language. I think the reason why we're seeing this here right now is because it is owned by Netflix. So with Netflix, there's no holds bad. And you see what you get, you see what you want to say. I think, which was also depicted in My Name, okay? The other Korean drama, My Name, earlier this year. Now, this drama is Money Heist. You know what to expect with Money Heist, but here it comes with a twist. <laughs> there was this thing, you know, South Korea and North Korea are divided. So in this drama, South Korea and North Korea came under this treaty or what, 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 and North Korea Koreans were allowed to come into South Korea for better living, per se, better um, life, okay? But when a lot of North Koreans came in, they saw that life was just life, same as you have it in North Korea. It's the same in, in South Korea. People are suffering. People don't have enough to eat. So we have the professor. The professor was actually a former professor, actually, in the real sense of the word. And he was the one that actually brought the idea of amalgamating, not really amalgamating, but you know, bridging that gap between North Korea and South Korea and, um, you know, making them understand that when there's a bridge, when these two countries begin to communicate, begin to interact, the, the economy will be better. But at some point, I think he said the economy will be bad. Okay. I wasn't following that point. It was too, it was too back and forth ish. Now, moving forward, this professor rounded up just like the normal money heist you've been watching different versions of money heist it just depicted itself here mirroring itself here you have father and son you have tokyo who is from north korea you have this other guy you you have a lot of them there's this rich kid there who was a former medical student and now a tech guy he didn't want his face to be to be shown on, on, on national TV. But the thing was that the professor, as usual, was always a step ahead. This time around, he was dating the police officer who he knew, who he predicted to, to you know, to be the person that would be in charge of the whole oppression. And it happened like that. So you will see from one thing to the other, the rule was that do not kill anyone. I think they succeeded in the first um, six episodes not to kill anyone as much as it was a difficult thing to achieve. It's a drama, even though we have a lot of Money Heist versions, Money Heist Korea, they uh, tried their best 
to you know make it something that you will look forward to seeing something that when you are watching it you are just going with them not even minding the fact that you may have seen various versions of money heist you know that's the thing you won't say oh i've seen no money heist again no money heist i've seen it i've seen it i've seen it so many times the korean version of money heist was to die for the originality was intact the storyline was you know slam dunk it gave this like if you haven't watched money heist korea uh, joint economic area then you're missing because it, it's actually totally different from the money heist that you've been seeing so it was something that everyone looked forward to watching and everyone is so impressed about how they did it by the time i was done with the first six episodes i was so sad because i wanted to see more i wanted to see what was going to happen because it's a movie that is a drama that will keep carrying you from story to story how he did how the professor did this how tokyo did this why the reasons for this the reasons for that the reason for the police officer doing this and then the other you know investigator from north korea when he started suspecting the professor and he went to pay the professor a visit i'd encourage you to see this drama in case you haven't seen it it's on netflix or you can still look it up you would um sure it's on drama color i don't know you'll find it However, where you find it and um, do watch it, it is the best watch ever. I'll be rating it right now. So far, so good. I'll be rating it a 10 over 10 because there was no loophole. There's no, um, oh, but they should have done this there, but they should have done that. All the effects that were needed, the effects were on point. It was straight to the point. There's no loophole. There's no, there's no, oh, the sound is bad. Oh, in, I won't be surprised if Netflix is really pumping a lot of money, but I don't know how well. Right now, it's in the top search on Netflix, the top ranking search on Netflix, but I don't know how well this drama is going to fare um, on the international platform right now. Um, it's still too early to say. Not really too early, but uh, I'm not seeing it ranking that high. I hope it improves because uh, it's an excellent drama to see, which brings me to the the end of this drama review money heist korea joint economic area 2022 six episodes so um you can look it up and watch it okay up there you see my korean movie reviews my chinese movie reviews my nigerian movie reviews and then again my movie reviews thank you so so much for doing this with me if you haven't subscribed don't forget to hit on the subscribe button don't forget to turn up your post notifications to be alerted when new videos come up thank you so so very much for doing this with me i appreciate you to come by next time bye